Hey everybody, I'm John Bilfus, executive chef of Lula's Louisiana Cookhouse here in gorgeous Owasso, Michigan. And it's happy hour. When you own a closed bar, it's always happy hours. Awesome. But anyways, yesterday I made you a video of how to make vichyssoise. And when I was all done, I left the cameras rolling while I made dinner for Morgan and I, and I made one of our very favorite Greek dinners, a Greek shrimp saute. I'm gonna run that tape for you right now, and I sure hope you enjoy it. Here's everything you're gonna to need to make my fantastic Greek shrimp saute. About a pound of peeled and deveined shrimp, tails off, a 14 ounce can of diced tomatoes, a couple tablespoons of oregano, a couple tablespoons of capers, one small red onion minced, a pinch of red pepper flakes, two tablespoons of minced garlic, some salt, about four ounces of feta cheese, and a little white wine. First thing we're going to do is heat up some olive oil in a nice big saute pan. Let that get nice and hot. Then we're going to add our shrimp. We give that a nice sprinkle of salt. And let those sear nicely on one side. We'll go ahead and give those a flip. These are medium-sized shrimp, 21, 25. They should take a total of about three minutes to cook. And that's been about three minutes now, and I think those are cooked nicely through. So we're gonna remove the shrimp from the pan. And I'm gonna add our onion. And a pinch of salt. We'll knock this around for just a couple minutes to soften those up. And then we'll add our garlic. Stir that around for about a minute so you can smell that garlic really nicely. And I'm going to go ahead and add, oh, maybe a half a cup of white wine. Now I just want to bring that to a boil and cook that wine down. I've let that cook down for a couple minutes. I'm going to add some red pepper flake, our capers. Some nice oregano. This is Greek oregano, but you can use any that you might have. And now I'm going to go in with my tomatoes. <clears throat> these tomatoes are Santorini tomatoes. I've been on a Greek kick. Got these from Santorini, which they're just beautiful. But any um, plum tomato, Italian tomato would work just fine. So we're going to bring this up to a boil. And now that that's come up to a nice boil, I'm going to turn the heat down to low and let it simmer for about 10 minutes. So that's been about 10 minutes now, and it's looking about the viscosity that I would like it to be. I'm going to go back and add our shrimp back in. Stir those around. Sure, they all get in there nicely. And now I'm just going to crumble feta over the top. And I'm just going to cover it for a couple minutes to help that feta melt just a little. And after a couple minutes, I've taken that top off. Let's taste it for salt. I'm going to add just a little because that feta is salty. I'm going to top it with a little fresh minced parsley. And I'm going to serve it straight out of the saute pan. Beautiful.
Hey, thanks for watching another exciting episode of Scratch Cook with John. I've got a lot more recipes from all around the world, so I look forward to seeing you again.